when the heart gets stirred, the heart likes to feel like freedom is an expansive state of being. The heart likes to feel love, deep love, and true love and acceptance. The heart is a place where I tune in to create forgiveness. My heart is sensitive. My heart speaks to me in sentiments and feelings and emotions, the language of which can only be understood in silence. My heart is a reservoir of sadness. Sadness that I don't even know where it comes from. My heart is a secret chest full of treasures that are unknown to me. My heart has a tender voice and an even tender soul. My heart is that which connects me with you, with everyone in this galaxy. My heart is the one that connects you to me. Our heart are the most beautiful organs in the ecosystem of our being. The mind creates a chatter, noise, conflict and fighting and pain and endless, endless thinking. The mind creates sorrow, creates toxicity, running from lifetimes of reinforced habits, unconscious habits. The mind clings to the ego, clings to that which it feels safe in. The mind is scared to explore. The mind just doesn't know sometimes. It cannot see what's beyond. It cannot understand that which is pure magic. The mind is rudimentary. It's basic. The heart, the heart is infinite. It sings in languages of love from all the corners of this cosmic existence. The heart embraces all that is. Heart is the heart is the warmth producing, soul energy producing organ. The place where we tune in and it sends reverberations of peace and love. That space in our being and our body and our soul is heart. That space of infinite love, infinite acceptance, infinite surrender is heart. Heart clears that which mind contaminates. Our hearts clear that which our minds contaminate. The hearts speak in soft language. It's not loud and oftentimes silent. It requires for us to come into a calm surrender for the communication to begin. The heart is always calling out to us. The heart is always wanting to connect. Our psyches run amok in the patterns of unconscious behaviors, wrecking themselves over and over and over again, getting tangled within its own self, lacking clarity, lacking guidance. Our hearts are the space of abundant, abundant self-acceptance where the mind can find no respite, where the mind does not know how to stop, the heart can heal. The heart can bring so much healing. Tuning into the space, tuning in to our hearts, and then feeling the energy, feeling the light, doing nothing and just being in it, in the pure surrender of heart embrace. It's the moment of invoking a communication to our own heart space, coming into silence, into peace, from a space of agitation, irritation, from a space of total lack of authenticity. That's why we, we feel depressed and anxious, because there is, there is total lack of authenticity in this world. People lie to us, and if they're not lying to us, then they're 
putting up a face that is not real and it's hurtful and it causes anxiety creating space for tuning in to our own hearts to listen to our authentic selves to listen to our true selves to create a space of peace a space of safety and acceptance of who we are in the now moment right now without having to accomplish anything without having to do anything right now in this moment total peace can be achieved by just tuning in and coming in to our hearts a quality of silence that is so underrated there's always a background noise our own minds thinking 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 never stopping there's always background noise then we come in we tune into our hearts we experience moments of deep deep inner silence that can only be cultivated through practice inner work tuning in to ourselves there is nothing on the outside that can ever or will ever satisfy us but cultivating a relationship with the universe cultivating a relationship to our own selves a space where you can listen to your own heart the voice of your own heart feel your own heart without thoughts without noise without any drug just the heart and the music of the soul is enough is enough when you feel alone when you feel betrayed when you feel like nobody can really understand who you really are on the outside then turn in words and look at your own self and that's where you're going to find authentic love true acceptance within your own heart within your own heart Thank you.